Good evening all. This is our latest build here. What we got is we got a 36 inch feeder bowl, 20 gallon hopper by Victoria Controls. This one here controls the uh, hopper itself and then you got your main controls for the bowl right here. This uh, should be ran at no higher than 60. Um, at 60 it'll do a five gallon bucket in roughly 18 minutes. Kind of give you a pan view of it. This bowl also has an air system. Has a dual air system. The one air system is for when embedded cases come by right here. It'll blow the cases off of uh, the pile. If they start getting on top of each other, it'll blow it off. And you see that when I run this uh, airport right here will blow off any aluminum cases, put it in the chute, and then go down in the hopper. This bowl has 10 stations uh, for 10 different heights, two of them currently not being used. It's on a planting table, roughly around 2 inches thick. Estimated weight around 6,000 plus on this. Um, this bowl runs very, very efficient too. Um, we got a control here for the monitoring how much brass is in there. When I put my hand, you see how it turns it on? That would have shut the bolt, uh, the hopper off. And when that light goes off, the hopper will run. So it's self-controlling. The one thing with the bowl, you got to watch. Right here, embedded cases. So when these embedded cases are present, they're going to come around and they can get jammed under the 45, um, some 10 millimeter, and sometimes the 38, depending on the point of being embedded. Um, no way around that. We are working on a vision system that would recognize that that was embedded, and then we'll add another chute to blow the case out, um, but that's currently in development right now. If we do come out with that, that will be able to be added to any bowl. Um, but right now I'm going to end this video and shortly after I'm going to make another video strictly of it running. This is bowl number 42. It is available at the uh, price of $19,000. Uh, have any questions? Give me a shout. Thank you.